okay. Um, listen, we, we don't want the baby to spend another night here, so we'll get ready as fast as we can. Yeah. Why don't you two figure out how much time you need, and then I will just write the order after lunch. That's good. <laughs> um, does that sound okay to you guys? <laughs> yes. Yeah, okay. That sounds yeah. fine. Yeah. We get to take the baby. I know, right? Yes. I'm so sorry. Oh. I really, I have to go. It's okay. Thank you for everything. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you know what? The one thing I do wish is that we had enough time to nail this custody down. Me too. But at least Allie wrote a letter saying that she wants us to have the baby. That's not legally binding. And when Sammy finds out that this baby is with us, she's going to go ballistic. Um... I'm starting to think that maybe you're changing your mind about keeping the baby at home. Like sand through the hourglass, so are the days of our lives. When do you give me orders? I missed you. It's been two hours. We have so much time to make up for. Have I told you how much I love your new hair, do you? Yes, you did. Actually, mm -hmm. I love everything about you. Especially your eyes mm -hmm. and these lips. You're just trying to butter me up. Just being truthful. No, you're trying to make up for being a bossy pants. Me? Yeah. <laughs> I am not just some bimbo who drops everything when you get lonely. I actually had a full schedule today. I think you should eat something like you know, cheese strength up. Well, that's a three-course meal. I was just going to get a yogurt out of a vending machine. Well, here's the best friend, Dave. Why don't we skip straight to dessert? to the hospital and um one of the nurses there told me that the baby's gonna be discharged today so today yeah today i guess he's eating like a champ so everything's good i just uh you know i thought you should know that wait where are you going to will and sonny's i got him a, a baby carriage you know a carrier but I guess they won't be needing that now. Maybe I'll just give it to Nicole and Eric. The hell you will. Nicole is not taking my grandson anywhere. If we bring him home, Sammy's going to go into high gear. She's going to make our lives a nightmare. She's counting on you to think that way. That's how she gets what she wants. She's my sister. Yeah. I love her. She's also a bully. She's going to hire a platoon of lawyers. So it doesn't matter what Allie wants. Right? Is that what you're saying? No, I'm saying that Allie chose us before she was alone with Sammy. I'm pretty sure she was thinking, what would drive my mother the craziest? She didn't do it to just stick it to Sammy. Look, she stayed with us. She trusts us. And that's because, unlike Sammy, we didn't try to make up her mind for her. And she knows that we wouldn't do that to her son either. The only thing is that we don't know how this is going to work out. That baby needs and I want it to be with us, even if it's not forever. Well, we better go buy some stories if we're going to take that baby home. <laughs> <laughs> 